Hello and welcome back to Exapunks. Today we are going to hack into KGOG TV and upload a new television program to a satellite broadcast system. You know what really moves people? Art. I already don't like where this is going. I've been working on something creative, an abstract video piece. It's an expression of some of the ideas I've been developing around shape, form, and color. You'll see. Let's get it out there. Okay, okay, okay. So, 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 so. What we're going to do is align the satellite dish with the target satellite by setting the azimuth, elevation, and frequency. Then transmit the data from file 301, add encryption using the user encryption key. <clears throat> the azimuth elevation frequency of the target satellite is in 300. Note that you must align the satellite dish before transmitting any data. For more information, episode 2 of the Z. Let's see if episode 2 actually tells me anything I need. Because a lot of times it's just like uh, lore more than hints. So, look to the stars, 22. Da, 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 da. Communication satellites are amazing technology. They can relay long distance telephone calls and even some live broadcast TV stations around the world. Anyone with an interest in modern communications infrastructure should learn something about how satellites work, especially since they're only going to become more common over the next few decades. Establishing a connection. Though they might seem intimidating, the first satellites are really just expensive computers that happen to be in orbit around the Earth. Talking to them isn't hard. The first thing you need to know about is positioning the dish. They need to be aimed precisely. This position is used for the dish. Since anyone can play a satellite dish as I think they always have to be they aren't encrypted by the very end. To encrypt the sequence of values, add the first value of the key to the first value of your data, wrapping back to zero when the sum reaches 10,000. So if the data value was 7407 and the key was 3894, the sum would be 11. Three or one, which would have been said to be one three or one. Okay, that's super fascinating. That actually does give me all the answers. I am concerned. about that thing of if it's greater than 10,000 because I don't think we can go above that. Yeah, number too large. Copy um, 9,000 to X, Addy X 1500 X, and I would just copy XT just to see. All right, tab, dunk, dunk. Aha, uh -huh. see, it just does not, 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 which is not good. So that's going to be the trouble. I don't think positioning the satellite's going to be a problem. I 
I do think... that the encryption is going to be a problem. And you can show goal if you want. It's not a big deal. I mean, I don't know... We could do something where if it becomes... If it becomes 999, we can test for that. And in that case, let's do a different thing. Um... But what would be the different thing? I have an idea. I have an idea. Okay. So we're gonna have two bots for sure. Uh, 300's a whole thing. So grab 300, link 800, link 799, seek five, copy F to freak. Um, seek. Negative five. Okay. I don't think, I, I think, I think it said I have to use the motor. Like, I can't. I can't just copy file to Asm. Like I don't think that works. I I'll try it, but I, like I said, I don't think it's gonna work. Negative one. Link eight oh one. Um, seek one. Copy file to. Here we go. Grab the file, jump over here. Jump over there. Seek five. Copy that in. That's good. Jump over. Jump back. Copy that. Yeah, that didn't do anything. Okay. I didn't think it would. I didn't think it would. But. What I do want to do. Eight hundred make seek one. No, you're gonna you're gonna like sink uh, three, but here I want you to seek one. Copy file local. Copy local to X. Yeah, you don't need to make anything. What are you talking about? Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> Link 800. 
Oh, maybe maybe I do want to put it in a file because we're gonna do a lot of testing stuff. Maybe I do want to put it in a file. No, I don't think I do. Uh, okay, so anyway. Test. Hashtag Azim. Greater than X. True jump down. Uh, otherwise, test as in less than X. True jump kill. No. False jump. Okay. So here, we'll test if it's is it greater than X. If it is, we jump down. If it's not greater than X, we'll test if it is less than X. If it is not less than X, then that means at this point it is equal to X. So we'll jump down to kill. We'll just kill ourselves. Um. Otherwise, we will do this whole thing. Mark less, mark down, mark kill. We don't really need that halt, it's fine, it's there. Don't worry about it. Mark less. Okay, so if this is less than X, then I need to copy one motor. Test SM equals X true jump kill otherwise jump less down copy negative one to motor Test zim is equal to x. True jump kill, otherwise jump down. That should be cool. So he's gonna get over there. And now he needs to, it's at 140 now and we want to change it to 123. So he should, test is greater than, it is, so he should jump down. Copy negative one, which moves it to 139, as you can see. Is it equal yet? Nope. So jump back up, do it again. And he's just going to keep lowering that as in until it gets to where he wants it to be. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So the next question. Is do we give another bot this? And I think yes, probably we do. So let's copy this. Throw a new bot in here. Have him link. Cut this out. Put that in there. And then he would link 801. But you, you're going to link 709. And then you're going to link 799 and seek uh, 
I think seek one again. Copy file to local again. And then we'll see. And then you're probably going to seek one again. Copy file to frequency. Okay. And one thing I want to do copy one to M, and then you can die. Okay, and then C, my man, U, copy that in them. And we're going to change the azim to elev, if you don't mind. Hello? Hello? Negative, negative one. Copy one to local. And then I'm going to void M, void M. So that should allow these gentlemen to all do their works. XC is doing something wrong. He's not on local. There you go. There's your mistake. All right. So they all have their thing. They're all doing their work. Six, twenty-three, and he sends that one out. Awesome, beautiful. The only wrong here is that you need to wipe. Okay. Now with our remaining ninety-two lines, we have to be able to tell this XD to wake up. Link to here. And he has to do this thing. After encrypting it which is going to be frustrating. I see, I, I see what's happening. I just need to decide exactly how I want to do everything. It's 
avoid him. I think... See, like, I think I want to link 800 here, but... It's gonna it's gonna cost me a little bit of time, but it's safer to do it down here. So what needs to happen? You need to... We're gonna mark I here. Copy. File to M. Otherwise, test. Mm, I don't know, maybe we need to copy them in. Yeah, it's probably going to use it. Kill, you need to just halt. Otherwise, we need to seek negative one, copy, without M, jump by. I think that's really all I need him to do. Just keep transmitting the encryption code. Well, test in a file. True jump down. Okay. 
that should be. So now, you wake up, switch to local, tell him to wake up. You both, you grab your file, you both jump over to the encryption server. So here's where we need to mess up. <laughs> All right, so. First and foremost, we're just going to mark A up here, test, and a file, true jump, kill, and on mark kill, we're going to copy negative 1 to M, link 799. Seek negative nine nine nine. Mark up. Test and a file. True jump kill. Whoop, true jump. And I suppose mark and halt. So if it's not the end of the file, then you need to copy file data jump up okay that's your little kill command beautiful still got 52 lines I'm feeling pretty good okay if it's not the end of the file then copy file to X addy M XMX. Addy XMX. Okay. Test X less than a nine nine nine. False jump B. If it is less than 999, copy 1 to M. Um, seek negative 1. Copy X to file. And I guess jump A. Mark B. So we're saying it is okay. Otherwise, we need to cop whoop, copy zero to M. Seek negative one. Copy file to X. Subby. X. Nine 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 nine. X. Subby X one X. Addy. X M X uh, now we should be able to say seek negative one copy 
text file, copy one to local, jump A. That's all I think I need. So we will see. We'll see how this works. First things first, we have A, B, and C. A will grab 300, which contains the satellite positioning that we need. And then B and C are going to change the azimuth and the elevation. So, grab 300 while those two jumped forward. Now he wants to jump forward as well. So we have A, B, and C. Now A is finally going to get his jump in. Seek one to get to the azimuth. Copies that to the local network where B is at. B is going to take that, jump over to the azimuth, and then he's going to start moving it. Meanwhile, A is going to link to here and send C the elevation. So it jumps over, seeks one on the file, sends the, uh, the elevation data. Uh, we already showed how B works, he tests. He has the azimuth desired position here. He had to test how it compares to the actual positioning. And then he will either put a 1 in the motor to send it up or put a negative 1 in to send it down. And that's all he'll do until he finishes. Me, A is going to get the elevation. He's going to go do the same thing. C, I think I meant. I think I said A, I meant C. A is going to just throw the frequency in there because that, they decided to make that one easy for me. And then he's waiting to be told that the other two guys are done. So they do their thing. Changing the elevation to where we want it. Changing the azimuth to where we want it. The first thing we get is the elevation. The elevation is at 36. Test is elevation equal to X. It is, so he jumps down to kill. He jumps back across. Sends information to XA on the local network, which allows XA to jump forward one. And now he's still waiting. Uh, XC is told to halt himself. He's done. XB is still moving the azimuth to where we want it. Eventually he gets there. He jumps back across. Tells XA he's done. XA is able to jump forward, switch his mode to global, and then copy a one. to the global network and at this point XD is the only one on the global network so his first thing his wake up is find something on the global network he does he gets rid of it he switches to local and that's the command for these two to start so XD will wake up the other guy grab the file while XE jumps across and grabs that file so now they are together. The first thing I decided to do was have XD just get rid of the name because we're not using that. So get rid of that. Test if we're the end of file. If we are, we can kill ourselves. If not, copy that into X and then add the number of the encryption that XE is giving me to it. Is it less than 99? If it is, Copy one to XE to tell me we did a good job. Drop back one on the file and copy it in there. Jump back up to A, do the same thing. It's all going to be good for now. They're just going to be overwriting the file until it becomes 999. Now we're finding a false jump to B. So at this point, we're going to send a zero over to. XE, tell it's not okay. They both backtrack and get those same numbers again. So what we should get here, and let me just see if this math adds up. We should have 7976 plus 3050 equals 1126. So what we want is 1026. And that's what we got. Beautiful. So yes, they're just going to keep overwriting until we 
Whoops. They've they've locked up. They've locked up. They're both trying to put things into the local network. I understand where this problem has come from, but not exactly how to fix it this moment. But let me watch it work again and I'll figure it out. Okay, so XE is going to copy into X. It's a zero. Is it equal to one? No. Is it equal to negative one? No. So he's going to seek negative one, copy that out. He should actually jump to A in that case. I think. So I think if I change this here to jump A and then put a mark A up here. I think that'll work just fine. So let's alter that again. If they do this thing, it's wrong. I'll give you the information again. You get to 1026, and now we're ready to continue working. I think we're good. It's a lot of work encrypting this thing. But it's broken. <laughs> they broke. Uh, let me, I just want to see this very quickly here. 7433338183213928212239842138213938 It's all right. We got all the right information. This is the problem. They're both trying to copy out. Hmm. I, I'm thinking this test is at the wrong place. That could be the case here. So. I'm going to put this down here. Okay. If they fail there, we'll do that. Otherwise, we'll do this. Okay. Is it is it less than 99? If it is, then we need to test the end of the file. If it is the end of the file, we need to tell the other guys the end of the file. If it's not the end of the file, we'll send them the 1. Here, we'll jump down there, send them the zero. Yeah, I think that's good. Oh, this one. That's what I wanted. Again, it's going to take a little while, but yeah, we're just changing when do we look for the end of the file. And. What? The fuck happened there? Son of a bitch. Test and file. True jump fucking kill. Go here. Okay. But that failed for some reason. <sighs> fuck. Fucking fuck. Oh, 
all the failures back there. We have the file correct. I just need to see what this bug is and fix it, and then we'll be good to go. Uh, bup, 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 bup. Okay, we do this thing. Test bit greater than is. Fail jump B. Copy that to him. This thing, four seven seven four. That's what we want. Okay. Copy that one over to him. Is it a one? Yes. Jump back up. That's good. Get the information. Okay, it's that. Copy zero. So let him know. Seek negative one. Bring it in. Subtract nine nine nine. Subtract the one. Add in the information he's giving, which is the 5860. Copy that to the local network. Okay, we got the number. Overwrite it. Oh, you're telling him it's good to go. Hmm, interesting. Interesting. You're telling him it's good to go. And I don't think that's right. That's not really what we want. If you mark B, you tell him it's not okay. We do the addition here. We don't need this test. So we just need to jump up to there again. I think. You can copy it into the file, that's fine. But I think we need to get rid of this jump A and make it like a jump C and put that right above the test. So. Jump C right here and then up here, mark C. And now we'll, up here we'll decide what we're going to send him. And that should fix that. Because now he's going to go up there, test the end of the file, and he's going to send him the negative one. So it was like, it was an instance of. What? You got to wipe that, my man. You got to wipe that out. Okay, that's fine. That's an easy fix. Test end of file, true jump. Um, instead of halt, just type in white. And that is done. Now, yes, uh, there, there was an instance if the end of the file happened to be a number greater than 10,000, then we would jump down into the B marker that I made. And there was another instance of sending the one, telling him it's okay to continue. And so what would happen is we'd tell him it was okay to continue. We would jump back up, he up here, start trying to do more work when there wasn't more work to do. So now, after we get in the B, we finish that work, we go back up and test, is it the end of the file? And then we make the decision. Do we tell him it's okay to continue or not? And that's a completed test one. But not test two. Which is interesting. So where... 
We got we got the math wrong here. We got 2144, they want 6132. Everything else is right. That math is wrong. I wonder why. So da da da. We're just gonna let them do all this stuff. It's 2144 already, okay. So we didn't end up encrypting that. That's fine. Change that. Change that. Change it. Okay. Do all this stuff. Change it. Jump back up to C. This is your encryption. 3988. That's correct. 32 minus is, yeah, that's okay. So you're going to copy end to x. Test the end of the file, no. Copy 1 to m. Tell them it's okay, continue. Why you. Oh. Why are you doing that? Is that what I want you to do? to the local. Good. Is it less than that? Yes. Is it the end of the file? Yes. Jump to kill. Tell them it's good to go. That's interesting. We seem to be overwriting some files more than once. But we're not overwriting that last one if it didn't send us down into B territory. So, I guess... When we get to the kill, we're just going to add seek negative one, copy x to file, and then do our thing, and that should solve it. Our cycle count's going to be bad because we're we're double doing some work, but you know it does work. So. Okay, you know, there we go. Yeah, you can see the second count's way up. You can see the kind of the reason for it. Activity is pretty good. Size is not great. <laughs> but that is a complete puzzle. What do you think? It was interesting. Made you think, huh? That's what all the best art does. If you want to know the truth, though, the video is just some garbage data headline around. It's that we put from the broadcast. All right, cool. Stuff is weird. Life is weird. I had the TV on and this weird creepy sequence of shapes and sounds came on. It was bizarre. Whoa, did you get a recording? I guess I should have. Sounds like an art project. I think that it was. I don't think it was. They don't put art on TV. And there you go. And with that, I thank you all so very much for watching. Only 50 minutes this time, a little bit better than typical. But we're going back to the bank, and you guys can remember how terrible the bank was the first time. So, I'm a little bit nervous, but I will see you very soon.